all right this is our week um our seventh update but it's week eight because i missed a week of um updating our islam so um these guys are also um still here they're still doing good for the most part um a little bit of fraying on the tails here and there but nothing too serious i think the most um damaged our most hurt fish is still our um, little blue hap over here. Um, if you can see, his tail is split up. But he's still eating real well. Um, still has his um, activity levels well, too. Um, our peacock is growing up to be um, quite beautiful, actually. Um, it's got really elongated um, color colorations, fins. Um, I, I really like the pattern on his um, anal fin, I believe that's what it's called. Um, the little dots. Yeah, and he is the biggest fish, even though our dominant male is a lot of them is slowly catching up um, and he's right here in the center here still very much the bully of the tank as well um, but again nothing too bad in terms of damage for the other fishes so that's good um, I believe this is our other possible male. Uh, of course, he's hiding behind the driftwood. Okay, we'll get back to him. Um, but yeah, uh, it's quite um, amazing how our um, dominant male has pulled away from everyone else in terms of size. There's a considerable um, size difference between him and um, the rest of his siblings. And um, yeah, there hasn't been any signs of pairing up between anyone, including um, our dominant male. And to be honest, at this point, I don't even know which one his mate is, his original mate was. If I had a guess, I'd say it's this one right here. Um, but yeah, they're, it's, it's hard to say. Um, okay, here's our guy. This is the one I think could be our other male. Okay, never mind. He's back to hiding. Okay, let me kind okay, of swing to the other side of the tank. Okay, here's a better look at things. Yeah, he's who I believe our other male will be. But no guarantees. It might be a female. I think his stomach coloration looks female, but he's got more blue than anyone else, so maybe that is what I think is making him look like a male to me. But then again, we'll see. Um, let me see. There's one more thing I wanted to talk about. And that's our smallest Islam in the tank. Um, he might be this guy right here. No, that's not him or her. 
Okay, maybe it's the one hiding in here. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, it was him. So he's the runt of the group, even though um, he's not that much smaller compared to his siblings. But being the smallest one too, he's also the less least colored up one as well. And, okay, that was a terrible shot, but... Yeah, he likes to um, hide more than anything because he is the smallest of the Islams, but um, he's surviving, so that's always good. Um, and here's our sh shot of our Pleco, our Brissimo's Pleco as well. So... Yeah, that's the tank. Oh, and our pink convict is still here. If um, we didn't see him or her before, but still not a mark on him or her. But um, yeah, I think he's growing pretty slow too. Um, but he's, I guess he's keeping up enough with the size of the it's a lot of them that nobody is really able to damage him. And I think part of it is because um, they, he looks different, more different than you, anyone else. Or at least between him and the other it's a lot of them, so um, they leave him alone too. But yeah, that's the tank so far. Till next time, we'll check out for today.